Right, we have this word problem in front of us, and it's a very, very exciting word problem, and uh, it states as follows. Laura is three times as old as her sister Mary. In seven years' time, their ages will total 38 years. How old are they both now? We solve this problem in a step-by-step -step fashion and we present a clear and very concise solution as follows. Right, so what we have here is uh, the solution to this problem. Right, to present a solution to this problem, we first uh, let X. Be Laura's age. Why? Mary's age. Okay, like so. And then now we are told in this part of the problem that Laura is three times as old as her sister Mary. So we have Laura, and then we have Mary. But if Laura is already three times as old as Mary, it therefore means that we gonna have to multiply Mary's age by three and equate the two, like so. Next, next point. In seven years time, their ages will total 38 years. Right, so in, sev in seven years time, meaning you have Laura's age in seven years time, we add seven. And then Mary um, also, we add um, seven, right. Mary's age, we add seven, but we understand that uh, in view of their real ages, right, their ages will basically total 38 years. So it's the summation that is oh, it's going to be equal to 38 years. Okay, what is the meaning of these? Right, so this means we have x plus y. Right, so we have, if you have x plus 7 plus y plus 7, right, which is exactly 38 years, it means that you have x plus y equals 7 plus 7 is 14. You subtract 14 from 38, and what you're going to get is 24. 24. Right, so now at this point, what we have here is that x is uh, equal to 3y, and this constitutes the first algebraic equation. And uh, now we have this here, which is the second algebraic equation. So what we then do here is we put, we put, one into two. We put one into two. And if we do that, one is x equals three y. X equals three y. So wherever that is x, we put three y. So we're gonna have three y plus y equals twenty-four. Right. And if you add these two guys, you get a four y equals twenty-four. If this is the case, that 4y equals 24, we can divide both left and right by what? By 4, so that y is equal to 24 divided by 4, and the result is 6. Hence, y equals 6. And uh, x, we remember x. 
right, x is 3y, x equals 3y in the first equation. So now we remember this and we put 3y. y, which is 18 like this. Thus, thus, y equals 6. And x equals 18. So, therefore, therefore, now we would have to remember our initial suggestion because suggested that x is lower as age. Right, so X is Laura's age and Y is Mary's age. So we then say, therefore, uh, Laura, Laura is, uh, uh, which is X, is 18 years old. And, uh, Mary, Mary is uh, six years old, is six years old, right, and uh, we need to just check, is this true, that uh, these ages are correct, are these ages correct? Because now we remember one of the equations that said that x is 3y. So indeed, it is true that x equals 3 times y. But also there's another equation that said that x plus 7 together with y plus 7, right, the result actually is 38 years. How true is this? Because if you add um, x and y, okay, you add uh, x plus seven, or Laura's age plus seven, you get twenty-five. You add six plus seven, you get you get thirteen. And uh, now, if you have thirteen and twenty-five, it's exactly thirty-eight. And so we have solved this problem in a step-by-step -step fashion. And uh, we are done right now, guys, in solving this problem. Thanks a lot for joining us and a very, very goodbye to you. Goodbye, everyone.